only eight professional fights so far. His name is Paul Sykes, and he comes from Wakefield. And he's a man who says that uh, he owes boxing much of what he's got out of life, because boxing has helped him to lift himself out of a rather bad rut. In fact, uh, he doesn't mind us telling you that he has spent a fair part of his life in jail. Well, tonight is his big opportunity to really make something of his life. Can he beat Gardner? It's going to be very interesting to see whether he can. Well, there's no doubt at all. Paul Sykes has brought with him tonight uh, a small army of fans. And his reception as he came into the ring was really quite remarkable. And far better, incidentally, than the champion John L. Gardner got. Paul Sykes, uh, of indeterminate age. It's appeared in the newspapers anything from 29 to 34. Uh, I suspect he's somewhere between 30 and 32. John L. Gardner, 26 years old, just a, a fraction under six feet tall, with 30 professional fights behind him compared to the mere eight that Sykes has had. Ladies and gentlemen, we now come to the main bout of the evening. This is a contest of 15 rounds, three minutes each round, to decide the heavyweight championship of Great Britain and the Commonwealth. Presenting from Hackney, the champion, John L. Gardner. And all the informed opinion says that the danger moments for Gardner will be in the first two or three rounds. He's been known to go over from big punches early on. Conceding perhaps two or three inches in height to Sykes. And just over five pounds in weight. Gardner's 14, eight and a quarter. And Sykes 14, 13 and a half. Actually a little lighter than it was thought he'd come in. He's about six feet three, Sykes, from Wakefield. Getting his chance very late in life. Gardner is a man who fights on aggression and determination and stamina. The further this goes, it's thought the more it'll suit Gardner. But he might have to weather some pretty hard stuff early on. Sykes jabbing well, looking a bit red round the left eye, Sykes, where Gardner presumably has caught him with a right. Gardner getting his own punches through, close in. Sykes doesn't, he doesn't mind going in close, although he's got the reach to keep Gardner away. old pace, more like lightweights than heavyweights. Won't keep it up for 15 rounds, that's for sure. Good right from Sykes. And an equally good one from Gardner. Tremendous first round. Both men finding each other easy to find. Gardner's own left jab, looking good. Sykes looking for the big one. Must find a big punch from somewhere.
That was a good first round and very even. Well, it was thought that Gardner might walk into some big stuff early on and might find all sorts of trouble in the opening round. In fact, it didn't happen. And he gave as good as he got. But both men were obviously very easy uh, to hit. So this is going to be a hard and sharp battle, but I doubt if it's going to be a long one. I don't see, for instance, that they can possibly keep up the pace they've set in the first round for very long. John Louis Gardner, 29 wins in 30 fights, just one defeat. Uh, but the one he had was disastrous against the American Dale Arrington in this ring at Wembley back in September 77 when Arrington knocked him out in 2 minutes and 20 seconds. Otherwise, all wins for Gardner. Jim Brimmel, the referee from Wales. Right hand from Sykes. Gardner took it high up on the head. Extremely fast. And really quite skillful, considering that neither man is noted for boxing talent. They actually look quite well suited. Gardner is a sort of mincing machine of a fighter. He likes to wade in and keep pumping away. He doesn't put people on the floor all that often, but he wears them down. A sort of minor Marciano. One or two anxious calls from behind me where the Sykes contingent are. Put them together, Paul, they're saying. Getting a little anxious. These were the rounds he was expected to do very well in. And Sykes keeps that long left going. It's a good-looking punch. Could give Gardner a lot of trouble because He'll have trouble getting past it. Sykes has so much reach on him. Gardner, some five or six years younger. Remarkably fast heavyweight fight. So far, a pretty good one. Catches Gardner with the right, slows Gardner down momentarily. Another very close round. Gardner had the best of it at the start, but uh, it's gone the other way towards the finish. 